The key to delayed gratification is understanding that trading what you want to have right now for what you want to be forever is rarely a poor trade. You see, the competition is not between your momentary craving for, say, a donut and some imaginary person who wants to have abs in the future. The competition is between your momentary craving for a donut or being the type of person who has abs because they have the willpower to turn down the donut. See, the truth is, your craving for the donut will come back. Even if you give in to it, it'll come back. But being a person who can choose not to have the donut, well, now you're getting somewhere.